Okay, guys, welcome back. This is actually going to be the uh, fourth episode in my new format where I'm running you guys through pretty much everything I do on the park, teaching you guys how to improve the park better, and just showing you guys all the new hybrids and dinos you can create and make and having a lot of fun battles. So first of all, we're going to start here upgrading the DNA production. And then we're going to move on to uh, get the food going for 24 hours. And then let's see what new uh, dinos we hatch here. here we got another Parasurlophus. Which actually have two of those. No, nah, because I, I created a hybrid so I used up uh, the other ones. So, Ankylosaurus, which that guy I could already get up to level 40. The Spinosaurus, I had this guy at level 40, but then I combined him to create a hybrid. So right now I only have two of those. And then we have... Dacosaurus. This is one of the ones that uh, Ludia actually gave free. I believe it was on the 12th uh, day of t rex Miss. I think is what they were having. And then here, uh, I showed you guys these things before. These things collect from all the uh, dinos around them. Usually about four, three or four in either direction. So just by clicking on those four, I could uh, get about 4 million coins. And then always collect your uh, free VIP mystery pack. That's important. Uh, you get one of those every time. I don't collect them that much because I, mean, I have plenty of them. I've, I mean, I got plenty of the dinos. And then uh, here we have my Stegoceratops. I am getting this guy up to level 40. So here he's just finishing at 31. I'm hoping I get enough food. Uh, and then this guy is going to be maxed out. You can see at level 31, he's 2,561 health. So that is awesome. Super strong herbivore. Let's see. Oh, I don't know how to get him. This guy's going to chew. Yeah, see, he chewed through almost 3 million food just to get him up to level 34. That is crazy. Well, he is at 2,701 health. He is awesome looking. Check this guy. I think when he's maxed out, uh, let's see what he is maxed out at 3,042 health. So, I believe that's going to be one of my strongest dinos there once I get uh, him fully maxed out. And then, uh, let's see what else. Usually, I will go check out the traders, see if they got anything good. Only thing I'm looking for right now is food. Really? Uh, Gigantocephalus? No, I don't want that guy. Cash, I've got cash, I've got... Okay, here's some food, but I don't want to use my loyalty points to get it. So, no good trading there. The Mammoth uh, Dome or whatever that is, is still under construction. And then, the Velociraptors. Uh, I, actually, I actually did those guys last night, so they are maxed out. I got a couple cool packs. I got one legendary pack, which was awesome. And then uh, we're going to jump into uh, this VIP only event for a legendary pack. Uh, if you're a VIP member, you get one of these uh, battle sets every uh, episode. So this will be five battles. So let's see what we could get. And it looks like they got a Dacosaurus pack also. Huh. But the Dacosaurus is one they gave for free. So... If I got time, I'll come back to this one. But uh, usually I like to get the VIP one because the legendary pack is pretty much the best you're going to get. So this one, I've got three herbivores, so I'm going to choose three carnivores. Uh, sorry, I'm sorry, 
Okay, I got the Rockman, Dimetrodon, and the Carnotaur to all fight in these three battles. So, first thing I'm gonna do is he can cause 158 damage there, so he's not gonna kill me in two hits. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put it into reserve. See what this guy does. So, he attacks me, which, like I said, did not kill me. If I attack three, uh, hopefully I can. I don't know. Oh, that's shit! Didn't kill him. So this time, hopefully he attacks two wife now. Okay, so I just gotta hit him one time with my dimension, and then I'm gonna pour uh, two into reserve. Next dino's gonna be able to kill me. And, oh, actually, he might have. Three, yeah, he's got three hits. It'll be. I don't think so. I don't think he's gonna kill me. In three. Okay. So that totally leaves him defenseless. So let's see. I could take him down in three hits, then I'll put three into reserve. Okay, so a Patasaurus. Okay, so he attacked four, which killed me. But uh, that's gonna leave him uh, totally defenseless. So I've got seven and battle over. Bam! Ten thousand two hundred and ten damage. Celebration time, little Dino. So that was battle number one for 50 DNA. Usually, uh, I got to line up with dinos deep enough to where I could go in there and pretty much wipe out all, all these guys. Actually, my Stegoceratops is not even close to my top one. Even at full health, he's going to be my fourth one. The Indominus at level 30 is 3,837 health. So here we've got two, uh... Carnivores and a uh, pterosaur. Okay, so here I'm going to use my uh, Prionosuchus, my Shunosaurus, and Coolosaurus. So let's jump right in. So this guy is definitely not going to kill me. Yes, I will have to make sure. Oh, wow. This guy almost killed me. <laughs> He could almost kill me in one hit, but he's not doing anything. So, I'm gonna bring in my shooting forest. I think I'm gonna split the difference one in reserve, one block. They're probably gonna bring back the part of the Okay. So, if he attacked three, a block two. See, he would have killed me. But uh, he left himself defenseless, so I could take him down in two hits, put two into reserve. And I mean, this battle is pretty much over at this point. Oh, he attacked three. <laughs> he needed one. Come on. Okay, so I could just wipe him out with my guy. is mine 50 dna jumping right into the next battle which is gonna be looks like a pterosaur herbivore and an amphibian so this one's gonna be a little harder 
Okay, then for this one, I'm going to go with Stegoceratops, uh, Spinoraptor, and Dimorphodon. So they're bringing in their Nucleodocus, he attacks one, so he is defensive right now. I'm gonna bring in my Spinal Raptor, I can't take him down in two, so I'm gonna throw a two into the reserve. Cause even if they switch to their Amphibian, hopefully they yeah, can't kill me in one place. pretty close, so I can't do that. On. I'm just gonna attack four and see what happens. Okay, just watch one. Awesome. Down for the kill. Got that guard with the guard. Okay, he attacked two. Yeah, I believe that was the one. From what I've seen, uh, Ludia is going to be bringing a huge snake boss uh, pretty soon, which is going to be awesome. And I was not able to get a mammoth yet, so I'm looking forward to getting that. So let's see, battle number four, what we got. Okay, so the, for this one, I went with my level 30 Pterodactylus, the Tanny Colagrius level 20, and the Mestontosaurus level 30. 30, so let's get started. So he's, he's not gonna kill me in one hit. I'm just gonna go ahead for a one to reserve. So even if he swaps off, the next Indominus is not gonna kill me. So I pretty much left him. I'm gonna bring in my Tanny Colagrius and build up my reserve. Uh, I'm gonna do one reserve, one block. Okay, so even if he attacks me, he should have been able to kill me. one one. So I'm gonna bring in my pterodactylus. Sorry guys, that, that was a mistake. So he's got uh, one left, but I can take him down in two. One more for the one he's got left, one into reserve. Okay, he attacked six, so he wiped me out, but he's got nothing left. So, I'm going to take him down to two. I'm going 
gonna pull a three. And I'm gonna put four into a uh, block just in case, and two is Okay, so he's got four, so I'm blocking four, so... If you attack three, I block four. One left, and this battle is over. Awesome. Down he goes. That was pretty cool. Okay, so 50 DNA, that's uh, four battles right in a row. Let's see if I could do the fifth. Okay, so for this one, I went with the Mesdontosaurus, Pterodactylus, and Indominus Rex. I had to pay to get the Mesdontosaurus and Pterodactylus out of waiting. But that's... Okay, so Roger stayed up. Okay, even if he swaps out, the next guy's not going to kill me in one hit. So I will bring in my pterodactylid. Wow, could I take Let's try. We'll be close. <laughs> Take it down in two hits. That was pretty cool. Okay, so this guy's gonna have to attack twice to kill me. Making himself defenseless. I should be able to take him down. Yep. Even yep. Deserve. Apatosaurus. Okay, so at this point, I'm just going to build up my reserve. Four in reserve, one block. Okay, he attacked me. So he didn't even kill that guy. But that's fine because I'm going to take him down to level 30 in Dominus. Legendary pack, guys. I went right through. So let's see what they're gonna give me. Okay, 2,500 DNA, $500, killer instinct, and this gap is Metis. And then that's gonna put me over 20,000, but I don't think there's anything I need. Yeah, see, I don't want the Tanny Colagrius because I would need two of them. Because I'm at level 20 now. I need two to get to level 30, and I don't have enough to get two of them. Here, uh, I'm going to hatch uh, Kulasukis, and then I'm going to get my uh, legendary one I just got, Scapignatus. Go ahead, hatch that guy, and I will hatch one more, which is Kulasukas. So, get those guys in the tank. At this point, I might be done for today. I mean, it is a shorter video. I mean, we went through those battles. I can't do the Dacosaurus battles yet. I've got 18 hours, so if I do those tomorrow, it should not be a big deal. It's going to start me right off with three uh, amphibian creatures. So I'll use probably my Pterodactylus, Dimorphodon, and Pteranodon to take those three down. I just don't really want to pay cash for it because I still have 18 hours. If it was last minute thing, I might go ahead and do it. Actually, let's go ahead and level up some of these guys. I got a uh, Dacosaurus here. I'm gonna get him level 10. And if I get, uh, if I get the other one, 
going to be able to get this guy up to level 30. A level 20, see he's only 213 health, a level 20. So he is a pretty low level dino there. And then let's see, do I got any other ones that need... Let's see what levels I have these. Okay, this guy's at level 20. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, also guys, uh, we could... We're not done yet. I could go up in the storyline. Uh, I've got the missions done here. Uh, as you've seen last time, I moved five bonfires. I collected 50,000 coins from a heliport and 10 solar trackers. So I have my last solar tracker right here. So let's go ahead and continue on in the storyline. Ah, uh, if it's going too fast, pause it and read it. I mean, I could read it. Security performed a search where Zira was last seen. They found a wristband. They think there might have been a struggle. For now, she's been declared as a missing person. Oh no, Zero got herself mixed up with Hoskins the last time we spoke. No telling what kind of trouble she's in now. I think I may know where she is. Oh look, a notification for my plant program. I really need to come up with a better name. Plant Planner. <laughs> nah. I know, Plant Nanny. It looks like some of the flowers are looking a little parched. Better go give them a drink. Okay, so I need to move a tropical boulevard next to an Invidian, which should not be a problem. Uh, let's see if I get any Invidians out here. If not, I'll have to move some of my Triceratops statues. Oh, looks like I do got some here, but I will have to go ahead and move this arcade. Then move this here. That'll take us through this part of the story one. So, so that was a really simple one. Some of these is so hard, guys. According to the plant map, these flowers should be in need of watering, but the soil is moist. I guess I have some tweaks to make after all. Mr. Mazrani, Mr. Mazrani, sir, have you seen Aunt Claire? She was supposed to have dinner with us tonight, but I can't find her. Ah, Zach, I'm afraid Claire is busy at the moment. Major park business came up last minute. Oh, of course it did. It's not like that, son. It's my fault. I don't know if you've noticed, but it's been a bit hectic around here lately. I'm sure you can understand. Yeah, I understand. Listen, let me make it up to you and your brother. Dinner and a movie are on me. I'll make a note with the hotel. Order whatever you like. Okay, so I need to move a Triple Crown Hotel between beside uh, Terrasoria Cineplex. So, there is the Cineplex. So I need to move the Triple Crown Hotel next to it. Okay, and then buy and place a Mosasaurus Sculpture. So, Mosasaurus Sculpture, go ahead and put him here. Okay, so that was a nice simple one too. Aunt Claire's not coming, is she? Doesn't look like it. Why, she promised she'd spend the weekend with us. What about pizza? She's busy with another stupid crisis. I swear this place isn't any better than mom and dad's. At least at home I could hang out with my friends. You're not having fun? No, I mean, yes, I mean, uh, I don't know what I mean. Okay, I hate this stupid park. Hello? Yes? Well, no, she's not here right now. How can I help you? Zara? Wait, 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 who is this? Her boyfriend? Really? Oh, man. Whoa, 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 slow down. No, we know. Say that again? You can track her phone? What do you mean you already did? Give me the coordinates. Okay, so I need to move three buildings. So, any three buildings. So, I'll move these heliports. Okay, and feed a stegoceratops seven times. 
Oh, I hate those ones because sometimes you got your dinos maxed out and you can't. Here, see, I don't have enough food to feed him seven times. I mean, he takes 114,000 food. I mean, 183,000 to feed him once. So, uh, this one I'm actually going to have to wait on, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, see, I can't even feed him. I don't want to spend $2,500 for food. So, uh, that mission is going to have to wait a little bit. And... I believe that's all we got today. So it was a uh, it was a good length. Usually I go here. Sometimes they'll give you extra stuff that they've come up with here, and per hopefully pretty soon they're going to be opening up the uh, woolly mammoth arena type here. And well, I appreciate you guys viewing. If you enjoy my videos, please click thumbs up, the like under the video, and also drop me a comment. I love reading your comments, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for viewing. Let me know if you guys like the new format, and thanks for being awesome. Click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos, and if you want to see even more, go ahead and click the subscribe button.